What's up my single chats and toxic gamers coming at you with an emergency video, right? Because everybody's like firing left and right. We got Nate Shot becoming a book author. He's writing paragraphs after paragraphs. Bruh. Everybody's going off right now. And you're probably like wondering like what is going on? Guys, the video that we got today, sit down, clench your butt cheeks. This video is gonna knock your socks off though. <gasps> yeah, the hair that are behind your neck, they're all gonna stand up. Guys, it is time that you fasten your seatbelts, like this video, share this video, subscribe. Check this. There are Roll live up. cheats on this monitor right now, and you can't even tell. And worst yeah. of all, they're completely undetected cheats. What's going on, gamers? Your dad's favorite streamer here, Caps Lock, back with yet another video, and it's a big one. We're going to talk about how people are cheating in Call of Duty and Warzone and how they look like completely legitimate players. Yeah. Before we get any further, be sure to hit that like button so that this video is Guys, seen. Like and subscribe, man. Listen, man, I don't mean to come off like this way, but let's be real. Some of you accidentally hit like on these cheater videos too. Yay! I don't mean to be that ag aggressive. Come here. Let me send you some kishis right now, okay? But let's keep a book here okay you sometimes accidentally like videos from the cheaters themselves so why not like this and subscribe shout out to the homie caps lock guys what is coming next this is gonna blow your mind seen by as many people as possible and if you feel that i earned it hit the subscribe button and yeah. the notification bell so that you don't miss future banger videos like this one many of you are familiar with cheaters from the days of early warzone one when magic yeah. pants oh, would man. headlock aimbot you from across the map with a dmr <laughs> or a car 98 warzone and call of duty have if you thought this was bad get ready for what we got today changed guys. a lot since those days but so is how people cheat Cheaters like Mr. Magic Pants here were what you would call a rage hacker. And Call of Duty players of any skill level could easily identify a rage hacker. Yeah. But they usually get banned pretty quickly, especially since the introduction of Ricochet anti cheat. Yep, yep, yep. But over yep, the years, yep. cheaters have adapted to this. They and have. they've done that by tuning their cheats to appear more like a legitimate player. Damn. But while still having all the advantages that they. Look at that, bro. Your Uncle Phil, where are you at, man? Uncle Phil! You need to, and when I say Uncle Phil, I mean like Phil Spencer, right? Bruh. Uncle Phil, you need to do something, man. Where is Biden? Where is he? Yo, Sleepy Joe, yo, somebody called Biden? Cut these suckers chicken nugget supply right now. That's an order. That's an order from a uh, brown man, okay? As a brown man, Bruh. I demand free online, but also uh, as a brown man, I demand our games to be cheaters free. Like the video if you agree. Their cheats have to offer. Cheaters just don't rage hack anymore, and yeah. cheat developers even suggest that they don't do it. And that's Damn. because of how fast they get detected. Many cheat developers even offer an in-depth guide of how to set their cheats up to look like completely legitimate players. Man. Because of this, the player base at large is under a false impression that cheating has gotten much better. That's not true. And I know this to be completely false, and I had to find a way to prove it. To do this, I did something that I would have never seen myself doing. Ow. I teamed up. Guys, the plot that you're about to hear is so thick that you're gonna be getting an erectile dysfunction though. Oh, shit. Yeah, I'm sorry to say this, but the plot that's coming up, man, you are not ready for this one. I don't think that none of you folks are ready for this one. It's chalked. It is Joe over as... The kids like to say nowadays, no cap. With a very knowledgeable longtime cheater. I did this to understand how bad the problem really is in the game right now. These cheats are being used by many people in ranked play, tournaments, Damn. wagers, content creation, and even public games. Call of Duty is completely infested and the anti-cheat isn't able to stop it. I do ask after seeing what I'm about to show you that you absolutely do not go and harass streamers, competitive players, or Call of Duty staff online. I do, however, ask that we hold Call of Duty and its studios accountable as a collective and demand for a- I, I do agree, right? Like, you you don't want to go ahead and call out, like, the, you know, Nadia and her friends be like, you don't want to, like, let's be real. Most of them just got, like, big ass eyelashes. They cannot even see your comments. Like, they're like, dee, dee, dee. you know what I mean? They cannot even see your comments. So why waste your energy? Type in comments in their com uh, in their comments while well, you can actually make some real change by actually <laughs> going hard at Activision. When I say hard, I mean real hard, okay? Obviously, you don't want to be uh, coming off as a toxic gamer. You want to slow your rules, but guys, it's time that you wake up, okay? It is time. Do not look behind you. Yes, I am talking to you directly. Yes, you. Not somebody that's behind you, okay? Real working anti-cheat because at the end of the day, that's the only true solution to this problem. And it's Agreed. only going to get worse until that happens. Oh, First, let's start 
by how people hide these cheats on their PC. Now, cheaters who want to try and hide it, they're going to store their cheats on an external USB device. Oh, crap. Yo, we watching like Mission so Impossible 20. Put the USB when you want to insert your... Hacks. They use these options so that cheats are never downloaded directly on their PC. Everyone's using this one because it's super safe. It's been safe for over a year now. Oh, man. Uh, you're gonna get shadowed, but you get your account back within seven days. I've been using that for- I'm pretty sure while you're watching, you can already think about like, you know, that guy cheats. This guy cheats. That guy, that YouTuber. Excuse me, I know this YouTuber cheats. Who do you think cheats? Let me know in the comments below because I know Swag, he doesn't know what a radar hack is. The man likes to- ding, 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 ding. This is what these kids are doing. I mean, junkies out there, like, they're tick, 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 they're juicing around. Uh, you know, gamers, uh, they're like, ah, oh, whatever, man. Let me actually get that. These suckers cannot function without their aimbot, though. How many times you see these suckers go from being a god at a video game and when they're being, a, when they're god at the video game, they're using, like, these, at these hacks, right? But then, all of a sudden, you know, in lane, sometimes, not all the times, we obviously catch these suckers cheating in LAN events as well, but sometimes you see them act like a bot. Why is that? Because they're off their cheats, their aimbot. For a long time, everybody that gets shot out uh, saying, oh, I just got my account back means I'm not cheating. Stop getting shadow down and that stuff out. They just fucking lie. And they boot completely from this external device. This makes it much easier to pass a PC check if they're ever found out. Cheat developers even have tutorials on how to fully pass a PC check if a cheater okay. is ever called out. Okay, so once in the... The cheat manufacturers are putting in more work than Activision ever had. <laughs> Bomba God! You're like, what the hell is going on? Game, on? press 7, uh, app menu, pretty standard app menu. Uh, ESP, loot, roll bar, uh, and that. The, everything about, uh, uh, to make it look as legit as possible. Okay. Uh, so it's not, uh, rage hacking software. Damn. So the aimbot, even max setting, will look pretty, pretty close to aim assist. Uh, so if you put just legit setting, let's say you go halfway, it's gonna look like an assist. Yeah, bro, bro, like, put your cursor a little bit above the sister, man. That's, like, that's disrespectful, bro, like... <laughs> like, you be putting your cursor over uh, over the sister boobas here, bro, like... You're gonna oh. miss bullet, you're gonna get killed by controller. Uh, so it just looked pretty legit. Well, same thing, just basic, basic, you know? Okay. Oh, damn, he's standing up right now. Oh, my goodness. Just little basic back menu. You can see everything there. Yeah! Loot, radar, aimbot. Okay, so he's moving his mouse, and you do not... That's like the... For example, you can already envision, right? Like, this is how it looks like when these things are streaming. They're like, you know, yeah, yeah. You're probably like, eh, okay, so this guy's probably, like, thinking about it. Like, he's moving his mouse. But when he's moving his mouse on the other monitor, he's seeing, like, the cheating menu, though. Oh, shit! Oh. Yeah. Uh, just... A it's pretty basic hack uh, software. So one way to do it, you put your stick figures and your ESP basically super pale, uh, transparency all the way up. Uh, uh -huh. Even for me, it's hard to see. So when I look through all like that, you guys can probably not see it. Yeah, I don't see it, bro. But, but these things see it, right? Man. Yeah, and, and due to all this, of a sudden, many tournaments require players to use a monitor cam to prove they're not using wall hacks. Unfortunately, this isn't effective either yeah. because, as you can see, when tuned right with the right transparency, even wall hacks or 2D radar are impossible to see and they can be turned off with the click of a button. And for those yeah. that don't know, this is why a lot of these suckers also use like foot paddles. They click a foot paddle. <laughs> Yeah, I know it sounds kind of hilarious. It sounds kind of funny like foot pedal. What the hell is that, right? Most of you are probably aware, but I recently ended up getting a comment in my comment section where a guy was asking me what a foot pedal is. And I was like, bro, this guy is so new. No disrespect, by the way. I understand. Listen, even me a year ago, I was like that guy, right? Like even me, I did not know what about what I don't want to know about foot pedal, dog. Bruh. I don't wanna, but these things are the reason why I know about it. So I'm like, bro, this guy's my past. He doesn't know. He's innocent. I'm not gonna respond back. I'm not gonna let him know. But if you happen to watch this video, my guy, my boy, if you don't know what a foot pedal is, you are very far behind. And that's a good thing. That's a good thing because we don't need more cheaters though, you know what I mean? <laughs> but dog, like foot pedal, with foot pedal, it's like a hotkey, right? You, you click it with your uh, foot. Bruh. 
and you can activate aimbot you can do whatever i mean listen a foot pedal can be very very uh, it's ca it can be a good thing depending on what you're doing if you're video editing you can use that and you know it's a hotkey right it can be used for a different stuff as well and if you have wired it the way you like or if you have connected the way you want you can also turn on and off the lights in your room as well it can be used for good things as well it's not all about the cheating but most of these sickest what they do is that they put an aimbot and they use it to enable and disable aimbot and i mean this uh, what he said was wall hacks yeah you can do that with that uh, with that too so. so 2d radar is just an active radar on your mini map that's like a uav but it's always up and as you can see that means monitor cams aren't even effective to prove someone isn't using these cheats. And the cheat developers it's even over. offer suggestions on how to set these up too. Even aimbot settings, when tuned correctly, look exactly like aim assist if used in this way. And you would never notice the difference in a kill camera by spectating. Also, I want to show how people make aimbot look uh, like aim assist. It's almost impossible to tell if... Uh, yeah, Z laner always get accused of that by Dr. Uh, Disrespect as well. I know there's people using crazy settings that's gonna snap on people uh i'm not really targeting those people i just want to show how people that want to look legit uh the streamer tiktok whatever they're doing uh i want to show how those guys do it to make it look like uh it's aim assist yeah you got basically it, everybody know how aimbot work we got an fov little circle in the middle i don't know if we can see it there so yeah, basically everything in the middle of this circle Oh my god. So basically everything in the middle of this little circle yeah. uh, Amos will up. register on target. So all I have to do is go in my aimbot settings, uh, smoothness, I'll go right in the middle. Yeah, you can try tune the right settings. In the middle. Uh, yeah, I truly do believe because Z laner is uh, accused, and we did a video on Z laner Doctor Disrespect yesterday because Doctor Disrespect him the Tatman. They were they were calling Z laner out, right? In one aspect, it feel like that. They, in one scene, it felt it felt like that they were joking, and surely they were. But in another scene, we got multi we had multiple clips, right? Where it felt like that they were not joking though. So I'll I'll link you that video in a second. But you know what? It, a lot of people accuse Z laner. Some people think he's cheating. Some people think that he's not cheating. Other people think that he's using Kronos and he's using uh, and. That is cheating by the way and he using that to up the aim assist now if you're using a software or hardware to up the aim assist versus like because a normal player has aim assist but they do not have aim assist like the way these things have right if you're using a software to up the percentages like he said softness or you know if you're increasing the percentages of how fast you can like can lock on the target i mean come on now man i mean damn homie so fov just so i was able to show you guys i'll just turn it off there's no point and that's basically it okay so what happened now is that everything in this circle that's basically uh, it will have aimbot but my aimbot is set so smooth that when I go on target, it's gonna move slowly on target, and yeah. then I'm gonna lock on that. In other words, he means to say his aimbot is so, like, perfect right now that the, even the a mouse, the aliens cannot spot it, guys. Uh, I'm not crazy. gonna have some crazy, uh, snap on yeah, people like that. <laughs> it's not, there we nobody's are, using this one. This is why we're like, ah, ooh, ee, ah, ooh, ee, ah, ah. This is why we see Symphony do like that. Z laner sometimes happens, sometimes it doesn't. Like more often than not, Z laner overall, like we were talking about it, like he has map knowledge, map knowledge, you know. <laughs> you always hear those comments, but Z laner, objectively speaking, good player. He knows stuff, but he's juicing though. He's doing the tick tick ticks and tick 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 tick, like the big homie swag out there who doesn't know our radar hacks. Uh, the streamer, uh, whatever, they shoot and then they snap on something else. They're fucking with you. That's not a thing. Yeah. And for me, I use the. Uh, you what? can select any key you want. That's not a thing. To talk about the aimbot, I just press my shooting button. Some people will put it on media. Some people will put it on fire. Some people will put it on other stuff. Uh, I like on fire because every time you shoot, you get this aim assist. Yeah. Technically aimbot, but you get aim assist. Uh, some people oh, who use sniper a lot or other stuff, they're gonna put it on ADS so they get aimbot first and then they can shoot. Uh, everybody's gonna use either one of those keys. Back in the days, playing games was like a beautiful thing, right? Nowadays, you gotta play the game with, filled with skill-based matchmaking. <laughs>
uh, uh, you gotta dodge the microtransactions, the BBC bundles, and you also gotta dodge these cheaters as well, man. It's Joe over, guys. Nobody's gonna use foot pedal, uh, handbook, software on their computer. It's way easier than it looks. That's everybody's Damn. using small FOV, so you cannot snap on two target at the same time. And everybody's using a mouse button or either the fire button or the SM controller. Nobody's using foot pedal, that type of stuff. Oh my god, yo! I thought that, yeah! I mean, some suckers are using, don't get me wrong, but what he's saying that for this one, dog, it's so easy that you don't even need a foot pedal, bruh, like... Oh shit! Oh, shit. I'm on a different planet right now! Yo, Jesus needs to come in right now, bro. Jesus, where where you are, man? Like, I think the end is nigh, bro. The end is nigh. Jesus needs to come right now. Now it would be the perfect time for the second coming right now. Like, honest to God, bro. Okay, so I can show you on targets. Um, when I click, I have the aimbot on. You can see this. It, it almost looks like Genesis. It's slowing down when I cross the target. Yeah. Uh, Yes, you can have people that's gonna literally snap on. Damn. We're still talking about the people that trying to make it look like they're not cheating. Yeah. Those ones are the ones using. It's barely slowing down. You can't. You guys can see my mouse. I still have to move it, and it's just slowing down. But if I decide to just shoot and not move my mouse, I kind of stick into it. I can even feel the recoil. Like I still have to adjust my recoil. So basically, what it gives me is a tiny aim assist. Yeah. Uh, you can boost it up, but if you're already on Yeah, the this is why, like, a lot of viewers are getting deceived, right? And a lot of viewers would fight with each other. Some would be like, nah, he's cheating, he's cheating, bro. And some would be like, nah, bro, you're... He he's not cheating. Not every streamer is cheating. Which I absolutely agree with. Like, not every streamer is cheating. Not every player is cheating. But majority of the streamers are cheating, though. A and, uh, you, you know what? This kind of changes everything because now it's like... Holy crap, this is uh, also, I do uh, agree with you that this is also planting ideas and everybody minds that everyone is cheating. <sighs> and I know that's a problem. That truly is a problem because I genuinely, and I think you also believe that not everybody's cheating, but majority are cheating. And, and viewers will constantly fight with each other in the comments. I mean, I, I see the comments, you see that, you know what we talk, we all know what we talk in here, right? You know what I'm talking about, right? So it, it's like, with this one, I mean, damn. When does it stop? It's like, they can turn it off with flick of a, with a click. They can turn it on, they can turn it off. So it, it's, this cheating, it, this cheating is, des is designed to be so like, responsive to the point where that you can turn it on or off with, with milliseconds. Within milliseconds and also it's designed so you do not get caught with your, with your pants down. It is over! It is Denzo! Recently we had the AI cheating thing as well, AI monitor, and Dr. Disrespect calls Zlander out in this video. Check this video. This is one of those videos that I was talking about. Click on this video. This is an insane video. On the left, though, this is the entire history of how Kronos works. Some say it's not cheating. Some say it is. Is it cheating, though? Check both of these videos out, and I'll see you right there.